As I approach my villa, hidden discreetly among lush foliage, the distant hum of Semenyak's bustling streets felt miles away, replaced by the soft symphony of rustling leaves and chirping geckos. Pushing open the intricately carved wooden door, I was welcomed into a secluded paradise. Before me stretched a shimmering private pool, its clear waters reflecting the fiery Balinese sky. Frangy penny trees, with their sweet-scented blossoms, whispered secrets to the gentle winds, while the soft murmur of a nearby waterfall serenaded the senses. I felt like I had stumbled upon a secret corner of Eden. With a sigh of pure contentment, I towed off my sandals and approached the pool's edge. Dipping a foot in, the cool water sent tingles of delight up my spine. With a carefree splash, I was enveloped in a cocoon of refreshing serenity. Floating on my back, the worries of the world seemed trivial, replaced by the vastness of the sky above and the embrace of the water below. Every so often, a gentle breeze carried wafts of aromatic delicacies being prepared nearby, perhaps a sizzling rende or a rich bebek batudu. Bali, with its culinary wizardry, was beckoning, but for that ethereal moment, the world outside could wait. Emerging from the pool, I wrapped myself in a plush towel, its warmth a comforting embrace against the cooling evening air. Settling into a sun lounger, I was served a glass of chilled Arak Madu, a local cocktail with honey, lime, and the potent Arak. As the concoction's sweet and sharp notes danced on my palate, I realized how Semenyak's villas weren't just about luxury. They were soul retreats, a delicate blend of Balinese tradition and modern comforts. As twilight descended, the pool lit up with a constellation of submerged lights. With a book in hand and the serenaded nocturnal Bali around, it felt as if time had graciously decided to stand still. Nights in these private havens had their own magic. The symphony of cicadas, 